The Ghost and Mrs. Muir by R.A. Dick is a charming and poignant exploration of love, independence, and the supernatural. The narrative centers on Lucy Muir, a recently widowed woman who seeks to start a new life away from her oppressive in-laws. She moves to the coastal Gull Cottage, which she soon discovers is haunted by the ghost of its former owner, the roguish sea captain Daniel Gregg. Initially, the relationship between Lucy and Captain Gregg is contentious. The captain, a blunt and irascible spirit, is not pleased with his house being occupied by a woman. However, as they spend more time together, a deep bond forms between them. This relationship transcends the physical realm, delving into a profound connection that highlights themes of companionship and understanding. One of the novel's most compelling aspects is its examination of Lucy's journey towards self-reliance and personal growth. Moving to Gull Cottage represents a significant step for Lucy, marking her transition from a dependent widow to an independent woman. The captain's presence, while initially a source of irritation, becomes a catalyst for her empowerment. Captain Gregg's guidance, though often delivered in a gruff manner, helps Lucy find her strength and assert her independence. The novel also explores the tension between societal expectations and individual desires. Lucy's choice to move to Gull Cottage and live alone is met with disapproval from her in-laws, who represent the restrictive social norms of the time. Her determination to maintain her independence and follow her own path, despite societal pressure, is a central theme in the story. Captain Gregg's ghostly presence symbolizes a break from these conventions, as their unconventional relationship defies the norms of both life and death. The writing in The Ghost and Mrs. Muir is imbued with a sense of wistfulness and nostalgia, creating a mood that is both melancholic and uplifting. R. A. Dick's prose captures the beauty of the English coast, the solitude of Gull Cottage, and the ethereal quality of the captain's ghostly presence. The dialogue between Lucy and Captain Gregg is particularly noteworthy, blending humor, affection, and a deep sense of understanding that transcends their initial animosity. As the story progresses, Lucy's character development is paralleled by her changing relationship with the captain. Their interactions move from hostility to mutual respect and finally to a deep, abiding love. This evolution is portrayed with subtlety and grace, highlighting the emotional depth of the characters. Captain Gregg, despite being a ghost, is depicted with a robust personality and a palpable presence, making their relationship feel real and significant. The novel's ending is both poignant and satisfying. After many years, Lucy, now an old woman, dies and is reunited with Captain Gregg in the afterlife. This conclusion reinforces the idea that their bond transcends the physical world, suggesting a love that endures beyond death. It also brings Lucy's journey full circle, from a life constrained by societal expectations to an eternal existence defined by love and freedom. The Ghost and Mrs. Muir is a timeless story that resonates with readers through its exploration of love, independence, and the supernatural. R. A. Dick masterfully blends elements of romance and the paranormal to create a narrative that is both emotionally rich and thought-provoking. The novel's enduring appeal lies in its ability to capture the complexity of human emotions and relationships, set against the backdrop of a hauntingly beautiful seaside cottage. Lucy's journey towards self-discovery and the unconventional love she finds with Captain Gregg make the ghost and Mrs. Muir a compelling and unforgettable read.